easiest challenge yet. Oh. <laughs> Welcome. Gentlemen, whether you win or lose, this will certainly be your favorite game of the day. Ladies, here's how the game is played. All the ladies in the district have ribbons. Your job is to obtain them. Whoever has the most before my hourglass runs out is one step closer to winning the golden mask. You're all looking lovely this afternoon. All right. Then Trouble you for a ribbon. We have a winner! You have more ribbons than any man here. You've proved yourself a favorite of the ladies and are now one step closer to the greatest prize of all time. Are you ready to test yourselves with a game of speed and endurance? Many challenges lie in your path. The game is simple, but finishing it, near impossible. Start when you're ready. The first contestant to beat the course record is one step closer to the Golden Mask.
fastest and strongest in Venezia. You are now one step closer to the grand prize. Step right up! Come on, come on! It's time for a game of skill and agility. Who can capture the flag? Who shall win the prize? Welcome, welcome! The rules of the game are simple. Outrun your opponents, take the flag from the middle of the field and bring it back to your starting position to score. If the opposition holds the flag, you must knock them down to steal it. Be the first to capture the flag three times, and the golden mask may yet be yours! We have a winner! You've protected your flag and captured the enemies. You've proven yourself a warrior without fear and inch ever closer to victory! Longest in the ring. Benvenute Lottatori. The game is simple. There's only one rule no weapons. Fight until you are the last man left standing. Will it be you or two? Hmm. Who will win the golden mask? What are you waiting for? I'll risk your entrance now, for now! We have another challenger! There he is, Pa! You think you can outrun, huh? Ah! Uh. 
Looks like this one thinks himself some kind of campione. Go on, Dante. Show him how sadly mistaken he is. Dante! Dante, sí! Dante! to challenge our man in the ring? Do we have a winner? Ah, we have combatants! So that's how it's going to be, eh? Shall we dance? Ah, oh, no. You'll regret that! <laughs> See our winner claim his golden mask. Our winner has proven himself the fleetest of foot, the strongest of champions, the wisest strategist, and clearly a favorite of the ladies. With four games won lealmente, the winner of the golden mask is... <laughs> the winner of the golden mask is Dante Moro. Congratulations. We'll see you this evening. I'm sorry, Ezio. We could not have known Silvio would cheat as he did. <laughs> you should have. Sister, you told us to let you know if we saw that rotten culo who stole the golden mask. He's on his way to the Doge's party. I will go. I can catch him before he arrives and take back the mask. How? By killing the poor stronzo? Yes. You know what's at stake. No. If you kill him, they'll cancel the party. And Marco will retreat back into his palazzo. We'll have wasted our time again. Steal the mask instead. Quietly. My girls can help. They're already on their way to the party, all along the route. They can help you distract him while you acquire the mask. Va bene. I can do that.
let them have it. Buonasera, signore. You made it. Marco is on a boat, just offshore. He's set to make a speech in a few minutes. Use my girls until then. Move with them to stay out of sight. Beloved Doja Venezia. Benvenuti! Welcome, my friends, to the grandest social event of the season. At peace or at war, in times of prosperity or paucity, Venezia will always have carnival! They're done. It's 
not leaving the boat. I will have to swim out there. I wouldn't try it. You'd be spotted right away. Then I'll fight my way out there. Wait! Tonight, we celebrate what makes us great. How bright our lights shine over the world! That's it. Your pistola. The one you stopped the murder with. It's as loud as those explosions. Time it right, and you'll walk out of here unnoticed. I like the way you think, sister. <laughs> Too soon. I'm not ready. We rarely are. Que la morte non sia crudele. Requiescat in pace. A true hero. You must be exhausted. Come, relax. Ah, the savior of Venezia. What can I say? Perhaps it was wrong of me to doubt so readily. Now, we'll see where all the pieces fall. Enough of that now. You've worked hard, my son. I feel your tired body in need of comfort and succor. But I have such aches and pains, sister. I may need a great deal of comfort and succor. Oh, that can be arranged. Girls!
Ezio, Ezio. Sir Antonio wishes to speak with you. Grazie for the message. <laughs> there you are. Come, Ezio. I'd like to introduce you to an uh, associate. This is Agostino Barbarico, soon to be Doge of Venezia, thanks to you. È un onore fare la vostra conoscenza, illustrissimo. I'm sorry for the loss of your brother. He had it coming. He was bought and paid for by the Borgia. A mistake I have no intention of making. Come, Ezio. We have much to discuss. We've located Silvio Barbarico for you. He's fled into l'arsenale. <laughs> fled? You mean occupied? and joined by 200 mercenari, no less. You're doge now. Can't you command them to stand down? The committee of 41 has yet to confirm my ascension. And this little stunt of Silvio's has only made things worse. He has an entire army at his command. Then help me to raise my own. I figured you'd say as much. Bartolomeo Dalviano is the man you seek. He and his men have little love for Silvio. He resides within the military district, southwest of l'Arsenale. Va bene. I'll go and see him. Silvio Barbarigo. Raised by wealthy merchants, Silvio was introduced to politics when his father was cut out of the family inheritance. From then on, Silvio worked for his uncle, his father's killer. Apparently, he had a knack for persuasion. Quickly, he became his uncle's advisor, proving his worth by discovering a Saranzo plot against the Barbarigos. You're gonna love this. Before the plot could be carried out, Silvio throws an Easter celebration, inviting the Saranzos. There's a pageant for the children in the central courtyard, while Silvio escorts the parents to the roof. He toasts the family, then signals the archers hidden behind the courtyard windows. The Saranzos never plotted against the Barbarigos again. Fast forward ten years, and Silvio's living in his uncle's luxurious Venetian palazzo. According to the history books, his uncle died in bed. be one of Bartolomeo's men. What's happened here? Where is he? Silvio Stags attacked, took him deeper into the district. <coughs> North of here. Requiescat in pace. Oh, 
for a bit of coin! You realize you are in service to a traitor and a coward! Oh! Do you think I don't know why you chained me up? Do you think I don't know why? Who pulled Silvio's puppet string? I've been fighting his weasel of a master since before most of you put even glimmers in your father's... About goddamn time! I don't know if I should kiss you or slap you. Maybe both, just to be safe. That's quite all right. Who are you? I am Ezio Auditore da Firenze. I'm here to rescue you. <laughs> Let's see who winds up rescuing who. What do you mean? Down there! Stop them! Fall Great! <laughs> What's fun, Vito? Let's see what you can do! Finally, think you're interested! What fun is with me? Are we there yet? We should go. Agreed. There are still more heads to be smashed. Perhaps we should try and avoid conflict. Why? Are you afraid? No, just practical. Oh. Even that they outnumber us a hundred to one. As you wish, bella mia. Watch for the large one. Dante is called. Most of Silvio's men are useless. But that one's trouble. Ah, sweet Frida. How I have missed you. Silvio set his men to ransacking your place. Prepare yourself for a fight. Go! Let's see what you can do! Ah. No need. Fire! Oh, Think that's interesting! I'm ready to ah. 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 What the life if it's not lived free, eh? I'll not go back into a cage. Then you'll go into the ground. Kill them. Dogs! No! Let's see what you can do! What a mess they've made. Bianca, I hope she is unharmed. Bianca! Bianca! Is everything all right? What do you think? Look at this place. And poor Bianca. If something's happened to her... Aha! Oh, my darling. Thank God you're all right. Ezio, meet Bianca. Bianca, Ezio. Charmed. So, I know your name, but not why you're here. I have business with Silvio Barbarigo. I was told you could help. Ah, it would be my honor. But it's going to require more than just the two. Three of us to weaken his forces. How do you suggest we proceed? I'll go and ready my men for battle. While I do this, I'd like you to rescue those who were captured during Silvio's assault. 
I cannot, in good conscience, leave them behind. In Daisy, I will attend to it at once. Good luck out there, Ezio. This lot. Flood the cage, I say. Drown them all and be done with it. Silvio wants them alive. Thinks he can turn them to our cars. I wouldn't count on it. They're as loyal as they are stupid. <laughs> Many thanks for the aid, friend. We'd like to fight with you, if you'll have us. Segui me. We are with you, friend. Only lead the way. All right, this way. Let us join you. Together we will crush the Barbarigo! <laughs> <laughs> 